What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Macho Movie Madness. Yeah. I am your host, Brandon. Alongside me always is Chris and Andrew. Hello. Hello. And today is a very, very, very special day. <laughs> um, we are actually going to be doing our top movies of 2017. Today. Yeah. And since it's like six weeks in. Since it's six weeks in to, <laughs> to 2018. Or whatever. Yeah, whatever. Well, we we already hate 2018. Yeah, I, don't, <laughs> I don't keep track of time. No, I don't either. Just another day, we're, baby. We're, we're yeah. timeless, baby. Yeah. Timeless. Oh, hold on. I forgot my glasses. Hey. Oh, yeah. Get your, get your madness. Don't, I don't want anybody to see my eyes. Just start the madness, saying? man. Yeah. He wants to, yeah. He don't want you to look at him when he's yeah. lying to you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, so, uh, who wants to go first on their, on their movies, first of all? I will. Really? Okay. Yeah. I'm okay. good with that. All right. So, let's th- start at number five and go to number one. Ooh. Let's, let's keep the suspense. Um, I, I have some honorable mentions, too. Honorable. 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 Uh, should I say those first? I uh, say whatever the hell you want, baby. Okay, it's my honorable, show. honorable mentions is Logan. Good Did, movie. Didn't yeah, great good movie. movie. Didn't make your list. Uh, no, they're top five. I had some buggy boos with it. Yeah, but oh, me too. Um, no, I mean no, nobody else did apparently. It, it was it was everything I wanted to see. Oh yeah, I agree. Wolverine I movie. agree. I agree. Um, it. I just thought they could. I thought they could have done it closer to the comics than what they did, but yep. they never do anyway. So. Right. Yeah. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy two, awesome movie. Mm-hmm. Loved everything about it. It just just didn't quite hit, hit the. Well, I mean, there's th- that's the thing about this, and this is going to be a recurring thing. This this year, this last year was amazing. 2017 yeah, was. had a, so many movies. It was hard. Yeah. It was really hard. Um, Alien Covenant. Fun movie, super fun alien movie, which is really surprising to me because I liked it a lot too. But I, I didn't, I put it on my list, but I didn't put, I don't even know if it'd be in my top ten. Really? Yeah. Really. Well, I, I mean, I just, I had a lot of fun watching it. Is my thing, you know? It was, it's, I mean, far from the best alien movie, but fun. It's fun as hell. It is. It, it is, is fun as I hell. Agree. Uh, and I thought the cinematography was just. Well, beautiful i thought it was awesome it was it was just i thought it was night and day better than prometheus Some i did too. Might disagree, uh, yeah. but i need yeah. to see I agree. it I prometheus agree. left such a bad taste i haven't yeah. seen it yet well so, yeah, i think i think it, uh for people that hated prometheus i think alien covenant um will undo what prometheus it kind of mends the, yeah it mends it, yeah, yeah it mends a lot of it yeah and then spider-man homecoming yeah awesome movie very good movie. best spider-man movie I in agree. my opinion i agree I think it's the best Spider-Man movie we've ever had. Yeah, and, I, and, yeah. and Tom Holland is the best Spider-Man we've ever oh, had. Oh, I, I, hands and that's down. not that's hands not down. taken away from the other two, but no, this no, is it, it is, man. it is. is he's it? better than they are. Well, he is better he is. than it, but I mean, I like the other two. He's in, he's into it more. He is oh, yeah. Spider-Man. Yeah. yeah, right now, I think so. At this moment, anyway, this moment. anyway, number five, everybody, Wind River, Wind River. If you have not seen Wind River, pause this video. Drive down to wherever you get movies from. Mm-hmm. Boondocks video. <laughs> <laughs> Boondocks video. <laughs> and get that son of a bitch and watch it. It is, it's that good. Boondocks entertainment. I mean, I'm, don't, don't exit the video. You'll want to watch this, yeah. you know. And please be kind, rewind. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, rewind I'm that so DVD. I'm so sick of you motherfuckers out there. Deep, deep, deep. Deep, deep. Anyway, Wind River, amazing movie. Yes. Awesome story. It's told, the story's told in a, in a very different way than what it, it usually is. I love. There's only like a little section of action. I got one word for it. Real. Yeah, yeah. It's very real. Yes. Very real. It is very real. You not watched it yet? Yeah, you, Gun, the, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. I need to pause this and go. You need down to, to yeah. your story. You need to pause okay. what the fuck <laughs> we're doing. We'll right pause now. what we're doing. Yeah. Um. Hold on. Okay, we're back. Okay, Andrew. Went Andrew and watched just watched it. it. Uh, loved it. <laughs> yeah, that's, all, that's all he's got to say. He's in shock. He's got the sunglasses on. He yeah, can say that. Yeah. yeah, he's in shock. Yeah. yeah, you can't see me lying. Yeah, yeah. He, he bats his eyes real quick when he lies. Yeah. You can't see that. All right, number four, John Wick 2. And I, I really, when I started doing this list, mm-hmm. I really thought it was going to be higher up yeah. because John Wick is, man, it's, it's a hard thing to say, but he, it, John Wick is probably... My absolute new favorite action series of yeah, movies. I agree. It. I mean, there's nothing that can beat it. There's nothing that can top it. If they come out with something that's better than John Wick, 
my head will literally yeah, explode. Won't be able to handle it. I'll literally explode. I will. I'll probably just melt. It'll look like scanners. It'll literally here. be yeah, shaking. It, yeah, exactly. It'll look like scanners. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, and that, and that, I think that's all I gotta say. I, I, hope, I, I hope they they challenge you. We haven't. We well, haven't. I, I want to see that. We haven't I'll talked about that movie. But was anybody else as excited to. about the ending I, as yeah, I was? Yeah. Yeah. I Holy am. Crap. I am. Um, you know, well, I mean, me and Brandon started getting the John Wick comic book. Hell my God. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, I mean, it, it, it was awesome and it wasn't at the same time, but there, there's, it's just, it's just the first issue. So, I mean, yeah. we're, we're still yeah. waiting, but oh my God, dude, I can't, I can't wait. There's so much to explore. Yeah. All right. Number three, Justice League. One of the funnest movies yeah. you'll probably watch this year. Yeah. Really? I mean, it really is. Um, it was everything I wanted to see, except for, uh, Joss Whedon's recuts. I went into it expecting a Zack Snyder movie, and I ended up getting three quarters of a Zack Snyder movie and a quarter Joss Whedon movie. Joss Whedon movie. That would, that's the only reason why it's so low on the list. Yeah. If it wasn't for that. I think it was golden. the The casting is amazing. I there's I no so better too. casting. No, I think so. I think it's great. It's. Uh, I think this. I I think any. I honestly think any problems with that movie was because of the micromanagement. We've talked about this before. The micromanagement of of, of Warner Brothers and uh, all this bullshit going on with with Snyder and and uh, which he had to leave. Yeah. But you know, but just him having to leave and yeah. then we bring in fucking Whedon. That's, 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 I yeah. don't know. I'm well, just... and I think Whedon is a, I mean, I thought Whedon was a spy for Marvel. I mean, really. Yeah. I really thought he, he was. He, 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 and, which I don't really He was really going to Vince Russo come in and yeah, destroy exactly. them. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> he Vince Russo that bit. Yeah, yeah. He Vince Russo DC <laughs> Whedon! But, but no, it, it was, it was extremely fun. Uh, it didn't. You know, it had a little bit more comedy than what I wanted, but yeah, I think it had. I think it had the right it amount. Was, just because it, it was a little bit marvelled up. It was, if you mar- will. It was marvelled up. Uh, I think it had the right amount though, because it it wasn't overly. It wasn't Thor. No, you know, no, it wasn't just straight comedy. No, uh, but it um, the moments in it were amazing. Mm-hmm. You know, like with the moments with Superman were amazing. Uh, Anyway, anyway. Oh, they were awesome. Um, on to number two, Wonder Woman. And I really thought that was going to be number one. But then when I really thought about it, I couldn't do it. Yeah. And it probably should be. Because it's an amazing movie. It's the first of its kind. Yeah. Really. I mean, it's, um, I mean when it, is there any other woman superhero that's bigger no there's i no i can't think of why, any. Why, there's why, not one. i don't know how there could be you know what i mean there's not one yeah. and captain marvel ain't shit i thought her mama ain't shit <laughs> should have never gave money Get, you should have never gave marvel money anyway i thought for sure that they could screw it up yeah but they didn't like patty jenkins and Zack snyder just knocked it it was it was it was definitely one of the better movies of the year yeah like hands down it was awesome i had i had a shit ton of fun watching it yeah well and and i can go back uh because i've watched it jesus christ i've watched it like four or five times mm-hmm. oh, i've watched it, it i've probably out. watched it about that much and uh and it doesn't get old to me anyway yeah uh i and i did i do like the setting and everything that helped a lot so uh but anyway um number one Star Wars, The Last Jedi. The last. And the reason why it's number one, and I I mean, I don't know, you guys might not have the same list as me, but the reason why it's number one is because I simply just had more fun watching this in the theater than any of these other movies. They were all amazing movies. Every, Every movie that I've said... So far, this podcast. They're all amazing movies. They're all fun as hell. Some of them not not so much fun, but just really good. Yeah. But Star Wars was so much fun. 
I had, you know, I had, I had, I had just as much fun watching Star Wars: The Last Jedi as I did trolling people that trolled the movie <laughs> afterwards. Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. Like absolutely. for real. Yeah. Fuck them. Yeah, exactly. I, I mean, it was, it was good. It was good. Yeah. They, I mean, they can suck it. It's good. Suck I don't care. Deal. Uh, it's good. It's good for the franchise. It opens up so much more that you know you can't keep going. This franchise is older than me. And there's a lot of people that are pissy because they're killing off people. <clears throat> well, Jesus Christ, it's older than me. Well, you have to kill people. Here's a, well, here's it has a, to be done. Here's the thing. If they were going to do anything, and, and this is no disrespect to them because I love the characters. And, you know, I, I'm, I love those characters. Yeah, everybody. However, loves. yeah, exactly. I just, uh, I think if they were going to do something special with that universe and that and those characters i think probably 10 15 years ago would yeah, have been the time yeah. to do it and then you know you know what i mean and then yeah. and then really do something special maybe maybe 15 20 years ago as opposed to now now you have to kill kill them off and yeah because they're too old they but, are but the I thing mean, the thing about luke skywalker is i mean he can still be in every oh yeah every sure. movie from oh, yeah, here absolutely. on out yeah, just because he's gone movie. doesn't mean he's gone yep. exactly yeah, the only person that they didn't kill off was an actual dead woman. No one's ever really gone. <laughs> I could have, I could have acted that role. Yeah, I could have. Yeah, I could have looked right at with Carrie enough Fisher. CGI. Yeah, hell yeah. Give me a little beard. I'll look old. Look right at Carrie Fisher. Kissed her on her little forehead. Yep. Anyway, really gone. And then give her the dice. That's my list. Don't wear it out. Don't wear it out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you want me to go? Or you want to go? Uh, well, I can go. It's really short and, list. Uh, Andrew didn't watch any movies. <laughs> Andrew doesn't watch we, movies from, from the previous year. We've, no. we've decided that, uh, <laughs> I, I play entirely too much guitar and don't get out. Yeah. Uh, didn't, I, I remember sending Chris an invite. Hey, you want to go watch Thor like over Thanksgiving? Yeah. And he's like, ah, sorry, I can't go. And I'm like, I still had the chance to go. And I'm like, eh, turn the page. Isn't going to learn itself. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's hard to go to movies by yourself, though. Right. It is. Like, I, I know it people is. that can do it. I, I can. I, I mean, I can do it. I'm a big boy. I don't want to. Uh -uh. It's not fun. Uh -uh. Yeah. I'd rather do it at home. Well, yeah, exactly. If you're like, going to watch a movie by yourself, you uh -huh. might as well do it at home. If you're, I mean, if you're going to go to a movie theater and spend money, you want to have your friends with you. Or something yeah, the experience. To, the experience is yeah. better. Like, like I would have went and watched Halloween, but it was much better with people who wanted to see it, too, that yeah, right. went with yeah. me. So that was cool. Right. Um, My honorable mention... Uh, on vacation in Florida, we saw Captain Underpants because the kids were with us. So that's the only one I can really. And it was it was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, it was. fart humor and yeah, it was yeah. it was pretty good for what it for what it was. Yeah. Um, I've only seen seven movies this year, so that's <laughs> that new new movie, new new, new movie, new new. Movies. Um, my I guess my other honorable mention would be The Dark Tower. Yeah. Um, I was I've been waiting on that for years, and I knew they couldn't do it justice without doing like a mini series. Yeah. And they did their thing. There's there's a few unforgivable sins, like they gave the character of Jake the shine. Yeah. Which I, weird. There was no need for that other yeah. than But anyway, that would be my other honorable mention. Um number five on my list, um would be Guardians of the Galaxy two. Yeah. Yeah. Um I, I, hey, we just watched it again, I think two nights ago. Is this will be like the second or third time I've watched it. Fucking still amazing, man. Yeah, Mike, Michael Rooker. Yeah, I mean for real. Yeah, I, I liked him before. Oh, I, I've always liked yeah, Michael Rooker. Michael yeah. Rooker kind of made the movie. Oh, really? he did. I mean, he did. Yeah, there was a lot of really good parts in it. I, I'm, I'm a huge Kurt Russell fan. He's yeah. one of my favorite. Oh yeah, actors. mine too. And I thought his character is a little bit. Flat. Yeah, I got his name tattooed on me. <laughs> yeah. I, I thought his, his I thought his character was a little bit flat in this movie. A little bit. It was like he didn't know what to do because he's. Every time he's done a sci-fi movie, he's always been a uh, like a a badass, but it's always been within the human possibilities. Like he was actually whooping somebody's ass. Hey, I will say I will say that that young Kurt Russell CGI at the beginning was, was actually good. pretty good. Yeah, it was, yeah, was good. actually pretty yeah, good. It was good. Yeah. Maybe one and maybe one another Snake Plissken movie. Yeah, <laughs> they could do. We it. could do it. They could do it. I know we can do it. Do it. No, we went too far. <laughs> no, we haven't. We haven't gone far enough, Chris. Not yet. Something not yet by left, a long shot. Some things should be left alone, Brandon. Nope. nope. 
Number four. You'll fucking drop a trailer tomorrow and you'd squeal like a girl. <laughs> well, I <get> it. <laughs> Number four would be Star Wars, which we've already covered. Yeah. Um, yeah. My third favorite, John Wick 2. Yeah. I, I liked it. I didn't like it as well as the first one, but I thought I, it was it I, was up there close. Yeah. I can agree with that. In the same ballpark. Yeah. Still amazing. I thought, the, it, I thought the opening was weak. I thought they went, like they tried to go too hard in it. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Mm-hmm. And, right. that, and the, going too hard made it weak. Went hard in the, the first right. one. Dude, that stuff in the, the tunnels, one, though, or whatever it was. That, that, dude, that was that sick. That was so bad. That was sick. Oh my, and all the stuff with Common, I thought was oh, really yes. bad. Oh, yes. Yeah. The whole fucking movie was yeah, amazing. Yeah, the whole thing. I'm just, my, my hey. only point is, is, is that at the very, at the very first, <laughs> mm-hmm. they went straight into it. Yeah, yeah. Where in the, in the first one, they well, eased a, you into yeah. it. Well, and then whenever weird. he finally started killing the shit out of people, it was like, what? Yeah, what this motherfucker? Yeah, yeah. In this one, it's like bam, 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 bam. Slow. We already knew who he was, man. Just get right into it, baby. Exactly. I think um, I you guys mentioned it earlier. We didn't really talk about it much, though. Is the the ending, like that for me? Just it, it's yeah. everything. That yeah. that was awesome. Yeah. Man. If you don't think the next one's gonna go bam, 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 oh, right? right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be insane. <laughs> yeah. Of course you will. Yeah. We'll kill them all. Of course you will. It's fucking yeah, that's awesome! Fucking awesome! Yeah. Bring it all down! Yeah. Uh, and I think I should say Keanu Reeves. Did I? I've never been a big Keanu Reeves fan. Uh, you know, because I always just imagine him going, "Dude, whoa, <laughs> whoa, yeah." But in the last probably five to ten years. I seriously think he should be put up with the bet, like the top of the top <clears throat> actors all around. Acting, and, and nice and, guy. Well, my my point with the acting, with why the he should be good. put up with the top of the top, cream of the crop is yeah, cream of the crop going to rise to the top. The reason why is because there's only been one time that I can think of that he has taken a job out of his range. <clears throat> and that was Dracula. Yeah. Yeah. Every other movie is completely within his range. He knows, like, he never steps out of where he should be. Not you know usually. what I mean? Not, yeah, you know I, what I, I mean? Like, just... he always does a he always does a role that he knows he can pull off. Yeah. And, and Dracula, he wasn't quite the actor he is now. No, no it was I mean, bad. Was, it was, it was bad. Well, that he was, was pre- just lucky that he had Gary Oldman. That was pretty speedy. Hey. Anyway. Yeah, that was right before <laughs> speed. Speaking before of, speed, so. Speaking of cream of the crop. Still the Bill and Ted shit in them. Yeah. You want to talk about cream of the crop? Gary, Gary Oldman. Oldman. What? <laughs> Did you see him and, like, him and Dracula? How majestic that man looked. Dude. He could be Dracula. I think he is Dracula. For, he could be Dracula. I think he is Dracula. He could now be. That we, now that you mention it. I think he's Dracula. Now that you mention it, I think I'm bleeding inside my chest. <laughs> I think I'm bleeding inside my chest. And he's Dracula. Um, Gary Oldman was a majestic creature in that in that movie. Yes. Yep. That young one. That I think young Gary Oldman, Oldman should be put on the endangered species list. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> immediately. Immediately. Yeah. Pre- preserved. Yeah. Anyway, carry on. <laughs> yeah. I think we've but we've held you off so long. Right. Enough here. Top ten movies of two thousand seventeen, Dracula, <laughs> Bram Stoker's <Treasure. laughs> Anything with Gary Oldman. Yeah, any, with Gary. any movie with Gary yeah, Oldman is the top movie for Oldman. the year. Uh my number two would be Logan. I just Logan. absolutely loved it. I had long for a superhero movie like mm-hmm. that. Yeah. Uh my number one movie that I saw in the theater this year is Halloween. Yeah. No. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> Oh my God! I was gonna throw that in there. <laughs> That's why I had to it jump. Total, yeah, it totally counts. No, uh, uh, no, you can have it. My number no, one was Blade Runner. No, it wasn't gonna be my top number one, but I haven't seen. Blade I was Runner gonna yet. honorable mention it. Yeah. Uh, I didn't think you guys were yeah. going to. So um, I was gonna honorable mention. Yeah, we had so I'm much fun gonna... watching Halloween, dude. I loved it. it was I awesome. loved it. Yeah, no, I loved it. But uh, no, Blade Runner twenty forty nine was, was my yeah. tops. Yeah, it was. I I expected that from you though. I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Sci fi action yeah. nerd, but. Uh, my brother had seen it like a week before me, and he's like, "Whenever, whenever you get done seeing it, we got to talk. We got to talk." Yeah. And so, yeah, I, it was just amazing. Um, you guys haven't seen it yet? No, uh, I no. need to still. Poor Ryan Gosling. Like he st- he starts out the movie, and by the end of the by the end of the movie, he's just <laughs> as the movie progresses, he's just beat to a pulp. Yeah, you know? it's, it's as he should be. It's, it's right. coming. It's coming out soon, so I'll, I'll actually be able to watch it here pretty yeah. quick. Yeah, but so. it's yeah, it's it's amazing. I don't want to give anything yeah. away. Well, I, I mean, you can look at 
just still shots from it and tell that it's amazing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Without seeing it, you can already tell that it's amazing. And it's one of those movies that's nearly three hours long and doesn't feel like it's three hours yeah. long. Yeah. That's We're, good. Yeah. That's a good thing. I like long movies. Yeah, like uh, I, I do too, for the most part. I do. I mean, I there's do. there's some movies that don't need to any more any more if they're good. Man, I I love I love them. I, oh, I, because, I, I think yeah, I because, always have. I think it's just because you can you can do so much with a two and a half three hour long movie. Yeah, and if you're well, really, you got to think one of my favorite movies of all time is Lonesome Dove. Right. Yeah. That's I mean, friggin' six hours. I mean, if you're into <laughs> it, then then you can't get enough of it. And, yeah. That's and, why I wanted Justice League to be I three know. hours. To I your know. point, The Dark Tower was like ninety five minutes and mm. should have been like oh it yeah two hours and fifteen. Have been it should have been three hours yeah. long yeah, yeah it really should have been or two parts or some shit but you know what i had a lot of fun watching it yeah, yeah. i mean it wasn't it wasn't bad but i still i haven't watched it again though what could have been you know what i mean yeah so um stephen king loved it stephen king yo, well, he's paid he's paid he's to say fucking that. paid to say that <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I've heard him talk shit on other movies that he's done. That well, he's so wrote. is Mark Hamill, and he always re- backtracks. Oop, oop, I spoke out of turn. I st- I, I'm still contract contracted for one more movie. I got to shut up. Yeah. He, has he been pissing you off lately, uh, Mark Hamill, a little bit? Like just aggravating the. <sighs> yeah, little man, bit. that ending to Star Wars that that pissed me off. Yeah. yeah it's terrible. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> now Mark Hamill is just like every other old actor. <clears throat> They think since they've been around a long time that they actually got something that people need to hear, and it's not true. Yeah. Like, About everything, not just I don't, the movie, everything. I don't need to hear what I don't need to hear your thoughts. Meryl Streep. Oh man, <laughs> Meryl Streep is the worst. And there's so many. You know what pisses me off about Meryl Streep? People actually will come up to me and say, "I think Meryl Streep is the best actress of all time." Liar. No, you don't. No, you no, don't. you don't. No, you don't. Liar. You're lying you're wrong. to my like. That's fake news. If you're going to do that, put some shades on. Yeah, you better put the madness shades yeah, on. If you're going to lie, I'm going to start handing them out face, to everybody. Put some shades on because yeah. I can see it in your face. Yeah. No, that's bullshit. I love Jennifer Lawrence. No, you fucking don't. <laughs> no. You watch her movies because people tell you to. Yeah. E Tonight tells you to watch Jennifer Lawrence's movies. That's the only reason why you like them. Really? That's it? That's it? Anytime you see anybody respected on the forefront, it's, it's always like people like. Meryl Streep or Susan Sarandon or Oprah. So the older actresses that people just absolutely love. They're not that good. No. They're overrated. Oprah's not an actress. Well, you know what I mean. You, you but uh, they, people oh, love her. I, I know. They, people love they, her. Oh, they got to get out there and say something she profound was, to stay relevant. Yeah. yeah. She, oh, she was in such and such movie this year. Mom, I don't fucking care. Yeah, I don't give a shit. <laughs> How about She's that? terrible. How about that? When, when when somebody stands up and gives a standing ovation to Roman Polanski, I can't, I can't do it. Oh, yeah, do it. yeah, 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 yeah. You want to go... You want to go talking about that now? No, I don't want to go talking about trying that. To, Brandon's trying to get me fired up about Roman Plans. I can straight up get him Goddamn fired up. Goddamn child molester, and they're all to... fucking standing up there clapping for him. Oh, oh he didn't do nothing wrong. He didn't how, do nothing wrong. I know, I know how to get to him. I know your body. <laughs> she She was 14. She should have known what she was doing, okay? <laughs> and then they... It's like and then a, an easy button over there. And yeah, then oh, the, no, I well, That's right here on the Well, table. seriously, the same motherfuckers want to sit there and laugh about people from Arkansas fucking their cousins, and then they're and then they're standing up and supporting a a child molester. Yeah, I know. That's what they, that's what they did. That, there's some of them are doing the same shit with Harvey Weinstein. It's retarded. Did you see somebody bitch slapped him in a bar? <laughs> really? Yeah, that's hilarious. Yeah, he, he went out like he had a cap on, and he was all trying to be. Uh, like incognito, in, incognito. Is this like his first time out in public since this on all got happened? And this dude walked up and bitch slapped him. Oh my god! And he, he told him he he told him he's such a bitch. He wasn't even gonna punch him. He's just gonna slap him. It was hilarious. <laughs> I mean, I just, just slapped it's the hilarious, shit out of him. It is kind of hilarious, but at the same time, it's kind of stupid. Well, like whatever. Um, so uh, the moment. Everyone listening to this podcast has been waiting for my list, my <laughs> list, <laughs> and it's very similar to Chris's. <laughs> I mean, cause I know it's going to have one. We're just not two. On we're mine. just two fucking alike. Most I most know it's going to have one. Well, that's not gonna be well, on one of them was on the list, and then I and I booped it out of the way because of me, because of you. Yeah, ass wipe. Yeah, no, I didn't. I actually, I actually enjoyed watching this a little bit more. I but I, I don't th- believe you. I think, uh, man, both of them are good. I don't know. I, I, I went on, enjo- I went out of enjoyment on this one, kind of like you, instead of just like straight up. This was the best picture because I, yeah. I think, I'll just say, it, Wind River just missed out. It's number six. Yeah, 
I think it's one of the best movies of the year. I think it's one of my favorite movies of the year. Yeah. Absolutely. I think it's better than, I think it's better than my number five. You know what? As a movie, maybe. Hey, I don't know. I, I just had a better time oh, well, watching it. Are coming off. I had, I had a better time. I'll say it's the best drama I've watched in the last 12 years. For reals. Dude, I would have to think about that. For real. I ain't, I can't think of any drama. I better. can't either. I can't. But I'm trying to think. I can't think of another drama that's been that. The Departed. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that good. Was that 12? Yeah, that would be within yeah, 12. within yeah. 12. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I would. Okay. 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 In the okay, last okay, five okay. years. <laughs> I'm going to say. Oh, no. I'll say The Departed. The Departed is easily in my top five movies of all time easily for real easily and uh i wouldn't necessarily call it a drama for me i would call it a crime movie drama yeah or you know a gangster i was thinking crime drama i I would say gangster movie and i love gangster movies and 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 that is like the friggin ayatollah of gangster movies oh we need to do it. We need to do it. The part is the Ayatollah oh, of yeah. gangster movies, oh, yeah. of crime oh, movies. Oh yeah. Yep. Wow. That, uh, yeah. I put. Yeah. We need, okay. We need you to do you it. know you know how much I love Heat. I know. You know I how know. much I love Heat. I love this more. I can't. I can't believe you. I do. You better keep those glasses on. You. Okay. I think they're. I think you're they're one A and one B. Okay. You're sure. talking. Oh, okay. If man. we're we're talking Heat versus Departed. Okay. Heat has triple A. Five star performances from half the cast. The Departed has triple A five star performance from every single fucking person in that movie. I mean, that's true. That's true. I liked Heat better. The, uh, uh, Heat, Heat isn't. Heat has much better action. Much better action. Mm-hmm. The Departed is a much better story than Heat. Well, I mean, it, it, much better. I mean, you have the, the ending alone is what is what is what you're talking about. So that's what I'm saying. Like that's that's it. If the ending wasn't there, it Heat. Oh yeah, Heat all around's better. I, yeah, uh, in my opinion. I'm spilling a future podcast. Oh, we need. Yeah, we yeah. need it. We need it. I can talk about The Departed and Heat all day long. Let alone all good, day. good fellas. We're we're. Oh yeah, yeah. Exactly. You you start throwing in good fellas and Casino and shit like that. I could talk about those movies 12 hours straight without a break. I don't even need to go pee-pee. He won't even blink. You won't see him blink. <laughs> yeah, you won't see me blink because I got my glasses. <laughs> yeah, you won't even see him blink. No, I'll take him off so you know I ain't lying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so number five, because I haven't even got yeah, number so five at all. <laughs> yes, son, my bad. Yeah. <laughs> it. Stephen King's It. <laughs> nope. <laughs> you didn't even watch it, asshole. You're too scared. <laughs> you're, too, you're too scared to even watch it. I need to see it. It is definitely my number five. Yeah. It is in every way, shape, or form. It's one of those rarities where you get it's it is way better than the original. Yeah. Which is not saying a whole lot because the original was a TV movie. Um is a two part yeah, done nine, forever. You know. Ago. And now it's classic. Yeah. You know, people remember people were scared of it back then. Tim Curry still, is still I still am scared of it. T- Tim Curry is still one of my favorite actors and Tim Curry was amazing in it. I liked all the other actors in it too. Hey. Even though most of them were T V actors, I loved all of them. Yeah. I just think that this movie all around is fucking good, man. This is good. Yeah. It's scary. I mean, I don't know. I just, I mean, as scary as it can be. Um, when are they going to come out with the new one? I think they're saying 2019. I mean, they're or they're pushing it. I don't know. Like a sequel? Yeah. Well, it's a two parter because oh, because yeah. the, uh, the the original was a, was just the okay. kids. Yeah. It was just the kids' story as they were kids. I mean, and then there'll be adults in the second one. Um, number four, I put Wonder Woman down as number four. I was like you. I'm like, man, it's hard to. It's really hard to place Wonder Woman because Wonder Woman is really high up there. Yeah, it's a fucking amazing yeah. movie. But I, I like the my other three more. And we've already talked about Wonder Woman. Uh, we've already talked about all these actually. John Wick, I put number three, uh, just because it's fucking John Wick. Yeah. Uh, Justice League, I put number two, because it was special, man. We're I'm a DC fanboy. Yeah. I can't help it. Yeah. As much as I I wanted things to go differently. Not me. I I hate DC. I know you do. I know you do. <laughs> You're you you uh you're a Marvel fanboy. Yeah. Um, I wanted things to go down. We talked about the micromanagement and all that stuff. That sucks, but it was still all around a fun the ass moments, movie. Dan. The moments, dude. Oh man, Flash catching Superman. You know. Oh my god. Or dude, Superman dude, catching Flash. Dude, you I mean, have to see this shit. I know. Oh, I know you're not like Andrew's not a fan of comic book movies. 
Uh, and for good, re- and certain for, certain ones. For good like. reason, though. You are, you've always given me a good excuse. Yeah. Always. No, this is. This and is I good. and I agree with you. You're right, but I can't stop myself. Right. No, this is good. Man. Um, but this, it has its shortcomings, which you'll see when you do watch it. The very first friggin' five seconds, you'll see what I'm talking about. Yeah. But. Yeah, they, that that shouldn't that had no reason to even be in the movie at all. No, no. None. I thought it was. I thought it was one of those things. Well, we can't get around. We had to do it. I'm you could have sure, got around it. I'm pretty sure Joss Whedon just came in and was like, you know what? They ain't do it. They ain't out doing Avengers, bitch. That's what I'm saying, it man. Ain't like, gonna happen. like, and, and you, you, if, ain't, you, I ain't letting this if you, happen. If you talk to anybody about their bugaboos, that's the first thing they bring up, and yep. that, and they won't let go about it. Yep. Like, and I'm saying that that scene was not needed at all. No, at all. No. Not even. I don't even know why it was fucking shot. Why you felt you needed to fucking no. waste so much money to CGI his lip. Yeah, we didn't need that. It was like a, it's like a video roll from a camera phone. Yeah, the kids ask. We don't need that. Shit. I get the message. We didn't have to do it that way. No, fuck it. No, no. I don't. We didn't see, need and it. that's the problem. Joss Whedon thinks everything has to be happy go lucky, and it doesn't. No, it does not have to be. Trust me, I've they been reading. Had a montage. I've been reading. I've been reading Batman comics my whole entire life. Yeah. You do not have to have a comic book movie be happy go lucky. It no. can be down. Well, it can be a downer and still be good. The, there can always be Trust dark me. and then light within the. You know, like they they had the montage the beginning of everything going to hell. You know what I mean? Yeah. That, that's what they yeah. could have. That's what they should have done. That's it. Yep. It shows the. It, you, that was everything you needed to see. The world was in despair because Superman was gone, and they were slipping even further because he was supposedly their hope. Yep. Now, while I didn't think they did, he should have uh, came back like this too. He, he damn right. Well, I, oh, I'm saying there's been a lot of rumors that that was already the plan. I know. There's I know. Been a lot of shit going on, I man. I, I and we'll never know the truth. I don't yeah. think. Anyway, uh, number one was the Last Jedi for me as well. Yeah. I uh I I think like I said I had so much fun trolling the trolls. They they I thought they were I hate I think they hated for all the wrong reasons. Yeah, I do too. Um having a and different opinion is one thing, but the wrong reasons I can't. Dude, the one scene, the one scene in Last Jedi, there's so many scenes in it that I'm just blown away by. But the one scene that I that I automatically think of when someone brings up excuse me, uh Star Wars the Last Jedi. <laughs> Is that general lady, Holdo, fucking flying that or Hondo, light speed Hondo, 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 Hondo yeah, yeah Hondo, light yeah flying that uh, spaceship yeah. light speed through all those yeah star people destroyers. and people bitched about that like she was that's, only that's there to the do most that awesome oh scene God, oh it, well not that scene they just bitched about the, her character being there other than I don't to do care that. I don't care either I don't I don't give a fuck care. we should have had Akbar do it he was at least he would have been able like why what who gives a fuck what why, you come at why me do in, you care all of a sudden about me, Admiral Ackbar? You come at me <laughs> he would have been real. like, I've got him and it's a trap. Yeah. 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 You come at me yeah. in Welcome real life. Welcome to my life. trap, bitch. <laughs> you come he, at me in real life and like, tell me that, and I will slap your teeth out. <laughs> sounds like Freddy Krueger. Welcome to my trap, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, I, that, that awesome. now, if that would have happened, then yeah, I would be all for he that. Has, he has the claw gloves and... <laughs> been awesome. I'd be all for that. I'd be, yeah, that would been interesting. But... Where do you go from here? I don't know. Why? <laughs> I, don't I don't know. know. I don't know. No, I don't know. It's uh, why, why are we here? Why are we still here? Just a supper. <laughs> um. Uh. Anyway, I, I thought that was. I think it's the best movie. It's the most fun I had at a movie theater. I've watched it three times already. Um. I, the Luke Skywalker scene is still amazing, <laughs> dude. Like you, you take the dude. magic away that first time. Uh, or the second time, it's the magic's gone. That you know, you know what he is. You know he's just force projecting, but it's still amazing. doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Still, that just awesome. means you can catch all the little stuff. I know it, all the stuff that they tried to show you. Yeah, catch. it doesn't matter. I'd say original audiences of Empire probably said that to you. Ooh, the big moments taken away. Oh, after I know. This. I know. Oh, I but know. It, it. It's still legit. It's oh, still yeah. amazing. Yep. Yeah, yeah, it's still amazing. Yeah. Like I said, I think we we all think this is going to be one that we talk about from years years from now and yep. not now. Oh, I know. I will be. Yeah, I will be too. I loved it. Um. I do have some honorable mentions. I have way more than you guys. I just want to bring these up real quick because this was very hard for me. And, and I'll say if they're good or not. Um, did anybody watch <laughs> Solace with no. Anthony Hopkins? No, I did not. Very good movie. Doubt it. Uh, Split. Oh, I did not. I did not watch it. Split was probably in my not. top ten. Uh, I do want to, though. Split I do was need very to. good. Uh, I love the actor. It and was I've... good It was good prior to the, the twist ending. Yeah. You know, where, where yeah. it's... Yeah, in I already that, know the twist. In so. that unbreakable universe. There's a twist. Yeah. There's a twist. There's a twist. Always. There's um always. I didn't say Logan. I liked Logan, but it wasn't I don't know. Like I think it's an amazing movie. I just I think so too. I just um I, don't know. I think there was just 
I don't want to move on with X23. I just want to say that right now. I don't care. Uh, uh, I'm fine with that. X23 is bad, dude. Oh, I mean, she's a great, bad yeah, motherfucker, I, dude. I just want Wolverine in a fucking outfit, man. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Never gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. Never gonna happen. Guardians. Of the I don't know. He he's been saying that he might really? since Disney. Bring it on, baby. He's, he's too old now. He needs to... No, not, not no, Hugh Jackman. He... I want the new... I want a new... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want no, a new I'm Logan. saying Hugh Jackman saying that Hugh he Jackman. might come back if... If See, they want if they want him to and Disney asks him and it's going to be See, a... See, with him, I don't think he should do the yellow one. I think he should do the brown, dude. The classic well, brown. Well, I, I think they should always do the brown. Oh, see, I don't know about that. I like the yellow and blue. I don't, or the I don't yellow like and the black. yellow and blue. Oh. It's too little kiddish. What do you mean? It's the, it's, the whole it was, suit is the whole suit is kiddish if you think about it. Oh yeah, I agree. I so, agree. I mean, but no. the brown one's way more brown and way more manly. Way more I mean, manly. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Tell that to Macho. We tell that to Macho. <laughs> if he was yeah. here today, he'd boop you on the head. Probably. Uh he might come up out the grave. I guarantee right now. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy 2 was awesome. Start rapping at you. Uh, yeah, rap me. Rap me to death. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Baby Driver. Hulk Hogan was a bitch. What do you think of Baby Driver? Uh, Baby Driver was awesome. Mm-hmm. Loved it. Uh, Different. It was like three quarters of the movie, maybe a little more. Loved every second of it. And then, like the very end, I was just like, oh, "No, don't end like that." Uh, the only, the only, don't do that. <laughs> the only thing I had a problem with at the end was the fucking cops, dude. Uh, yeah, like the cops are not that good. No, like they are. These no, are not so they were unrealistic. Everywhere. They were like they yeah. were on his like ass like, every second of the way. Immediately, like this is probably the best driver this in the world, a, and the cops are just immediately on him. Yeah, like. Dude, they, really? Like they knew which road and he was going to... What, what like city? Old Auto or something. Yeah, what city were they in? Because um, I looked it up after watching this, because me and Brandon had this discussion. It wasn't Atlanta, was it? Was it Atlanta? I don't remember. Shit, I, I can't remember, dude. I can't. Anyway, I looked up on uh, Google the response myself, time man. of the police department in that city that it was based <laughs> in. Yeah. The response time was like 25 minutes. Oh, yeah. Get the here that's yeah. terrible yeah. like they knew what? which road he was going to be to have a roadblock yeah, exactly exactly he gets completely away this he is... gets away and he's driving through maybe, rural freaking... maybe their precincts are just really close oh my oh, yeah. god <laughs> this is the problem we have so stupid. this is the common problem we have in hollywood movies where you have you have a lot of inaccuracies and in, in inconsistencies with guns <laughs> you have you have this the police are always super police right. well, for the most part and uh, like forensics and shit's awful oh, too. Yeah. Like there's yeah. no forensic no. evidence. Like no. you can't do forensics the way they do in in, uh, in the movies in real life. It's yeah. just ridiculous. Well, they were gonna do more research on it, but Kevin Spacey kept raping the. the <laughs> yeah, <whole. laughs> yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> hey yo, I, I, I'm sorry you can't talk about him. He's I'm gay sorry, now. I'm sorry about that. He's we just got demonetized. Yeah, we just got we just got straight up. Kevin Spacey's a rapist, by yeah. the way. Yeah, he is. In case you haven't followed the news, yeah. everyone, yeah. Kevin Spacey is. That's a... why Baby wanted to get away from him. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I Kevin you. Spacey is a uh, a homosexual rapist. Let me let me tell you something, Baby. If uh, I mean, you get away from me, I'm going to break your legs. I'm going to break. I'm going to break your legs. I'm going to come after you and that little girl and your uncle and everybody and everybody. I'm going to rape everybody up out here. We've been raping everybody. <laughs> Demonetized. I can't afford to drive home now. Yeah, yeah no. exactly. We'll take your truck. Yeah, thanks a lot, YouTube. We're going to come by and take your truck and take our house and take everything. Take these mics. Tax the shit out of us. They might need to. They might, they might need to take to. my mic away. Ta- yeah. I mean, you just, accused of, you just accused a man of rape without evidence. <laughs> no, I mean, it was pretty much. That's, pretty, that, pretty what pretty do you much. think Hollywood's been doing for like the, a month? The fact the, the fact that he come out right after that to just try to like, cre- yeah, like create now, a lesson. I now choose to live as a gay man. Yeah, okay, you that's straight my, up did it. That that's my, that's my argument from now on. Not like, because you say. Like if my wife comes in and she's like, did you eat the last candy bar? I'm like, I choose. I now choose to live as a gay man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I cho- now choose to live my life as a gay man. It's been rough. I do, I do not remember. I have to think about what I've done and reflect on who I am as a person. And I now choose to live my life as a gay man. Oh, God. Kevin Spacey, what are you doing? Yeah. And now we'll never know what's going to happen on House of Cards, you dirty motherfucker. Dude, he was one of my favorites, too. Was he really? I, I I always thought he was a weirdo, but I oh, yeah, I, he's I a weirdo. I don't. Sure. I, I never was a big fan of him. I thought he was Dude, a, a talented for Kaiser Soze, man. Oh, oh well, man. that was yeah, that was good shit. Um, he's a he's a very good bad guy. Very good bad. 
neither one of you watched Thor, did you? Did you watch no, Thor? Okay, no. I'm not going to bring up Thor. Then Thor was on the list as a as an honorable. No, and I kind of feel bad that I haven't because I'm such a huge comic book fan. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, I already know what happens. Oh yeah, it's a lot. Of, it's just funny. I know it's going to be just a big joke, yeah. and that kind of pisses me off. Yeah, it's. Um, I mean, it's good. You'll like it. Thor's not a like joke, it. man. I know, I know. Thor is not a joke. Thor's comics are very serious. They, um, we don't need a joke. I agree. We need a serious friggin' comic book movie. Do you think maybe if there was a better actor playing Thor, no. they might go that route? No, I don't think they could do better. Really? Uh, looks a- wise, looks wise. I mean, Hemsworth is friggin'. I mean, he looks like Thor. Oh, he does. He does. You know what I mean? He does. They're, I, I don't think they'll ever get it right. I don't think they will. I don't think they'll ever please anybody. That's, oh, no. So they'll just hide they behind. They, I don't think they know what to do with them, so they're just going to... It's hide just all jokes. It's all, it's all I agree this. with you. It's I agree this. with you. Yeah, and he, I don't blame him. He's a, I really he's a don't. supportive character. Like yeah. no one wants to see this shit. I really don't blame. I really don't blame him. Yeah. Like I would, anybody. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna say this right now. Bold claim or not, anybody who says Thor's their favorite, I don't believe you. Yeah, I don't believe. I don't believe you. you. I don't believe. I don't believe you. There's no charisma yeah. there. There's no nothing. No, there's not. He's God of Thunder. He's awesome. Yeah, I like him, but I don't. He's not my yeah. favorite. And then there's so many people. There's so, especially girls. Oh, Loki's my favorite Batman. Bullshit. Loki's my favorite Bullshit. comic book character. No, he's not. You didn't Shut like Loki. Up. You didn't even like Loki until you seen Avengers. He wasn't even cool until Tom Hiddleston did it. Yeah, I mean, I, well, and I think that's that's most of it. Is Tom Hiddleston is he, awesome. Is he is an awesome Loki? Speaking of which, made, which just didn't make my list, but I saw the light. That was a good movie. Where really he played Hank Williams Sr. Oh, really? That was a good movie. Yeah, I've, I, movie. I, I, somebody else told me that. I didn't see that. Was I? I forgot. Yeah, I need. List, to, I need to watch that. Because I do me. like Hank Williams. Uh, actually, that might not have been on 2017, but either way, I liked it. I think it was. That's 2016 or 17. Yeah, first part. I don't know. It might have been 16 and then released in 17. Anyway, it was recently and it was good. Uh, Power Rangers. Yeah, I like yeah. Power Rangers. Um, I actually really liked the last fight. Uh, I did. I, I did. I liked it. And I thought it was a little I'm, goofy with Goldar. I, I, Goldar was terrible looking. The, but, the Zord was terrible looking. The Zords yeah, were awful looking. Yeah, it's just different. The suits were okay. It's just, I mean, it's I mean, different. You gotta do something different. Jesus Christ. I know, but it wasn't even good different, dude. When it looked did, cheap. Yeah. It looked stupid. It was, I mean, it was Lionsgate. See, somebody else could have got a hold of this motherfucker. It would have been awesome. Dude, Lion, I'll tell you what. Lionsgate... No. Well, Summit put out Wind River, but but that's not that's not a CGI Lion, action movie. Most most of Lion okay, Lionsgate has done a lot of big creature films. Yeah, they have. Yeah, um, Godzilla. Yeah. Um, oh oh, Godzilla. Oh my God, I'm drawing a blank. Were they Kong? Kong. Uh, no. Well. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they did. did. They did. They, they did. did Kong. They did Kong. Um, that was a good movie too. That was and, on the list. Uh, it's gonna have Boyega in it. The second one. Pacific Rim. Pacific too. Rim. They yeah. did Pacific Rim. They did American Assassin. Any, American Assassin was good. Any movie with giant robots, <laughs> count this guy in. I'm going to watch yeah. it. I don't give a shit. I mean, it was... Like I, said, <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Like okay. I said, I just think it could have been so much better than it was. Transformers that, is hot garbage, and I'll watch every one of them. Oh, well, yeah. I don't care. If it's, got, it's got giant robots, dude. I'm going to watch it. Need to do a giant robots podcast? Robot jocks? Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> did you watch American Assassin? No, I did not. Another good movie you guys need to watch. Yeah. That's what, I, uh, that's what you said. Okay. I think that's pretty much it. Logan Lucky. I did not watch it. That was good. I uh, hate the name. Why? I don't know. You just hate it. I don't know. I just, like, I seen, I seen it. I seen it in your store. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and I seen the name on the cover. And I'm talking like Barack Obama. But, um, <laughs> yeah. but I was just like, nah. I sound like John Stossel. <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, no, nah, I don't, I don't, I don't want any part of that. I just hate the name. I don't know. I don't know why. I'm shocked Kingsman's not on your list. Oh, oh my, my God. God. What have you done, Chris? Ooh. You forgot. Yeah, well, hold on. It wasn't as good as the first one, but it was good. It was, it was pretty freaking good. The dude. Gold Circle. Okay. Golden Circle. I Which, like you, I said, there's too much shit I'll t- to I'll think tell you, about. I'll man. tell you why. I'll I own t- a movie store. Hey, I can't <laughs> even like remember this shit. I'll tell you how. And I'm glad you brought that up. I'm glad you brought that up. If anybody, if anybody's still listening to me ramble, um, <laughs> we're all tired of it. I would. I'd put Kingsman. Wow, man, that totally screws up my whole list. Are you gonna put Kingsman really? in your top five? Yeah, I think I will. I th- I really do. Damn, I really do. That just popped know, in my head because James Bond's coming, and that might be the end of this podcast. I'm not oh, sure. Oh, man. 
Dude, it'll I, be I, the end of all of us. Dude, okay, I'll tell you. I'll tell you how Kingsman Golden Circle be the was the better than the first one. Not not overall. The first one was, overall was better, but I'll tell you how the Golden Circle was better than the first one, and that was in ridiculousness. It was way more oh, ridiculous yeah. than Elton the first John one. was awesome in the dude, movie. Dude, Elton John was the best part of the movie. He was fucking hilarious. Yeah, he was hilarious. Oh my god. I love the scene with the dog. Oh my god. The dog god. getting ready to eat the dude and, and he just like comes in. He's like <laughs> and, then it, and it's not it's not programmed to hurt Elton John. Yeah, he, yeah. Elton John's a friendly, so he's like come in, he's like, Hey <laughs> and it stops it yeah. stops attacking him because <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's hilarious. And then it like he just takes the dog out. That's awesome. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta see these. Awesome. Oh, dude. dude. Dude, Whiskey oh, was awesome. Man. Even though he turned out to be, you know, not what we thought. Yeah. Without spoilers. Yeah. Um, He uh, he was awesome. The rope, that rope thing was awesome. Yeah, it was awesome. The uh, lightsaber rope. And what about the part where with, uh, where Channing Tatum, because uh, I'll tell you a little something. I'll tell you a little something. There's something going on that... It makes people go ballistic, and there's different stages of it. And one stage is dancing uncontrollably, and Channing Tatum gets infected with it. Yeah, and so he's the one he's, thing he's, he's he supposed, should be yeah. doing. Yeah, yeah exactly, exactly. He's supposed to be like in this cryo chamber sleeping so that they can <laughs> heal him, and he, he's doing this stupid fucking like cowboy dance in his underwear down a hallway yeah. it's just so fucking yeah. hilarious yeah. Yeah. i you know and that's another one that i didn't used to like him i know but mm. i've came around so much on him i think he's hilarious Dude, when you're when you're 21 funny, you're funny. jump street really yeah. turned it around for me. when you're funny you're funny that's the exactly. same, same with matter. justin timberlake Dude, exactly he's so exactly funny I, I used to hate timberlake i never hated him i just i, oh, I did. him and, i hate his music like him I hate his music well yeah i I, I i but him and fallon together and no. shit's hilarious oh him on saturday night live is hilarious him yeah him and period how the hilarious. fuck did we get on justin timberlake i just i just what are we it's doing? natural progression of things on this podcast <laughs> hold on a second first of all you brought up channing tatum you brought up channing We're talking about kingsman i know but you brought up fucking channing tatum motherfucker it was all, all bets are off all bets are off all bets are off. I'll start going through a list of other hot, hot people. The, <laughs> Joe Maganello. There's a, there's a shout out to Joe Maganello. What was he in this year? I don't know. I don't think he was. He, he, no, he was in Justice League. Oh, yeah, that's right. Duh. Yeah. Duh. For like five seconds. For five seconds. Dude, Deathstroke. looks so good as yeah, Deathstroke. I know. Dude. I know. No. God damn. Oh, did you see they announced Suicide Squad 2 as well? Yes, I did. Yeah. Will Smith's coming back. Yep. All uh, of them are Margot coming Robbie's back. coming back. Jerry, Jerry Leto Jerry coming Leto's back, coming and back. most people didn't think he was going to come yeah, back. Yeah, and I'm glad he did. Me too. Uh, he's he's not... Um, he's like the fourth best... Okay, he's the fifth. He's in the top five of Jokers. Out of five? Out of five. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Out of but, five people. But He's right in there. Yeah, he's but right you, in there. Okay, <laughs> you you got you to gotta think, though. The Joker, all the way. The Joker is the hardest comic book villain to ever portray, ever. Nah. Nah. Who's who would be harder? Who would be harder? I was believing in the sunglasses are off. Oh man, that's true. Seriously, Str- I, fucking no blinking. There, no, <laughs> no one would be harder. It literally drove a guy to death. You had to, you had to, you had, you had to ask me this. Now I got to think about. it. You know I what I mean? It literally drove a guy to oh, kill himself. He, pill, pills and other nonsense drove his drove. Him yeah, but him. he was he was isolating himself before so that he could get in probably character so he could, and shit. Probably so he could do pills, not because. Well, he was you know I don't want I mean. to think about what Devito had to do to become the penguin. Well, he, he didn't, didn't have shit. to do nothing. He, do he just showed up. <laughs> yeah, he just showed he just up. Showed he just up. eats fish like yeah. that. Just yeah. Squawk, quack. <laughs> and that's yeah. All yeah. yeah, I guarantee it. You ever watch? Uh, I love his. I, I love his voice. <laughs> what the hell am I doing around here? And then he's like, "I hey, just put the suit on." All right. <laughs> you ever watch? It's always sunny in Philadelphia. Oh, dude, he's amazing. He's still the penguin. <laughs> yeah, he is. He never got out of character. Matilda. He was the penguin. Yeah, without the nose. Yeah. I mean, he was speaking a, of, he. Uh, that's hilarious when he bites that guy's nose. Oh yeah. That's oh hilarious. my god. Um, my, we were watching that the other night, and. and uh, for like the 800 millionth time. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. And my wife was like, oh, this movie is just way too much. It's just so gross. 
and because she mean? never she never watches it. Oh what? Well, there's and a couple like, gross parts. I was like, well, what? I was like, oh, I don't think it. It's not that bad, you know. As it's, it's made, it was pretty much made for kids mostly. You no, know? no. <laughs> and then I and then I like rewinded it to where because I was in the kitchen, she was in the living room, yeah. still watching it, and uh, and so I I came in there and I rewinded it back to when she said that, and I was like, oh yeah, he bites the nose off and then he eats a whole fucking fish in front of that dude, yeah. and it's a cold fish yeah, too. Yeah, by it's, the way. it's a raw fish. I can see where she's getting at. Well. <laughs> Well, you you can because because it was mothers, in fact, that were pissed off oh, yeah. about the movie. Oh yeah, and and McDonald's and moms basically got Tim Burton kicked out of the next movie, and yeah. we had to we had to cartoon it up more. Oh, he yeah. he didn't want to come back for the next it, one anyway. It was all about selling toys back then. No, but I mean he, he still he got would, he still would have done it. Though. He got carte blanche to do that movie. Yeah. So. Oh yeah, he yeah they, they basically sat down with him yeah. and they're like, ah. I speaking of Batman, I had a good uh, I had a good analogy to for somebody the other day um this guy was saying was talking about how uh this girl was so hot and but he 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 could never go he could never you know he's he's an ugly dude i won't say his name on here because he might listen but uh but <laughs> well, he's, he's gonna he's know it with, he's gonna know with the conversation well maybe but whatever you call him stupid that's his Chris. fault yeah he is stupid <laughs> he's stupid and ugly <laughs> but anyway he was like you know he's like oh yeah she's way too hot for me to go ask out and i was like hey i was like if Joel Sch- Schumacher has the balls to, put to not to not just do one Batman, <laughs> but fuck up two Batmans, <laughs> you got the courage to go ask that girl out. Go ask her, allow me to break yeah. the ice. Yeah, yeah, allow me to break the <laughs> ice. All right, everyone. Chill. Yeah. <laughs> Chill, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that fucking work comeback? On not peace. Did you see that comeback from Nickelback no. to Arnold? No. Oh, my God. Okay, so Arnold made a joke on Twitter about Nickelback, something about people that don't believe in global warming, and they all listen to Nickelback or something. And uh, like, yeah, like it, it was so it was stupid. And then uh, and then Nickelback actually came back at him on Twitter and was saying uh, something about him playing uh, playing Doctor Freeze. Oh, I don't Mr. remember Freeze. what it was. Yeah, but uh, oh my god, it hurt bad. You could tell was it hurt him bad because he's like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> You know, and he's like, it was hilarious because he's like, oh, like, you know, and when you read, when, uh, like, I follow Arnold on everything. Yeah. When you read his posts. Oh, he's hilarious. You too. can't help but do it in his voice. Oh, I know. I like, know. every time he's, he, like, types in ha ha, I yeah. go ha ha. Yeah, yeah, ha ha. <laughs> time, time to turn this mush into muscle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking yeah. of Arnold, I, I don't know. I can't remember this. Well, I guess it would have been 17. Killing Gunther. Killing Gunther. Killing Jesus Gunther. Christ. I loved Killing Gunther. I loved Killing Gunther. Oh my God. We did this all wrong. We, we, we did it all wrong. We're going to have to start over we're gonna again. We're going to start over. We're going to start over. No, we're not going to start over. Uh, I wouldn't have put Killing Gunther in the top five anyway. No, I wouldn't have either. But I, it, it was But it was I, it really was, good. It was good. I, it I wanted was. to mention it. It um, was weird. Two more Two more. I wanted to mention, and it won't be Halloween oh because God. Andrew Jesus stole, stole that from me. No, just two more. This guy goes on forever. Too much, dude. I got two more to talk about that you assholes probably didn't want. He had more honorable mentions than I had movies. I know, I know. Well, I had to go through because this was a tough, tough list for me. I've watched a lot more movies. Yeah, and yeah. there's going to be people out there like, "What the hell?" I think I think me and you've probably watched the same movies this year, except for it. Mostly. Oh uh, well, and I didn't watch American. You didn't Assassin watch a lot either. of these lists on here. I didn't watch Thor either. You didn't watch Thor. You didn't watch. Yeah, you didn't watch it. Didn't watch American Assassin. Didn't watch Atomic Blonde. No, I didn't. I liked Atomic Blonde. I probably will, but I'll the wait till you mark it down. First one. <laughs> <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> Uh, the foreigner. <laughs> foreigner. Oh yeah, you. Yeah, you was telling me about that earlier. Amazing. Yeah, I looks, love the looks foreigner. Looks good. Jack, I, I love the foreigner, dude. If there's one, if there's one Asian dude I love, it's Jackie Chan. Mm-hmm. I mean, you, I, okay, if we can set aside all the the superhero movies for the year, Logan, Spider Man, all of them, like you basically have, and even even Star Wars, even set yeah. away, I mean. Yeah. You've got. I would cons- and now I would consider Star Wars a comic book movie now. Right, right. Well, yeah. because there's more con, there's more, there's more Star Wars content in comic books than there is in the movies. If now. if you take all those away from our list right now, then our list completely change. Yeah. Mine does. Oh yeah, yeah. Because then I would put Wind River up there. I would put. I, I still have John Wick up there, and I would still have, and I would have Split probably up there. Yeah. And and then for, you got Foreigner and Atomic Blonde. Just something, diff, just something weird, different. Baby Driver would probably be moved up the list. 
Like that's that's what's so crazy about it. And I can't I can't use uh, Halloween because Andrew already stole it from me. That's right. But that was awesome in theaters. Yeah, it was fucking awesome. Yeah, it was. And I will mm-hmm. count it because it's 2017. And I, you know what? Released. I I noticed new stuff about it that I never noticed before. Really? That was the first time I ever seen it in a theater. So. Yeah, yeah. But, Did uh, you notice the guy over the hedge when they were walking back from home from school? Oh, the the goof. Yeah, the goof. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you notice that? Yeah, yeah. I love. Yeah, it. well, and oh, the the biggest the, the biggest thing that I noticed in that movie was um, when they go into the house and. Uh, Pleasant says they go up to the to the room and Pleasant says it happened right here, but it didn't. It happened in the room next to it. Yeah, like he oh, he yeah. took him into the wrong yeah. room and told him probably that that's better lighting happened. or some bullshit yeah. they had. To, then yeah, back then who gives a shit? And and well, yeah, I mean, it was just something stupid. Like I shouldn't even know, but I'm I'm just a super. Uh, well, when you when you when you're into something and you've yeah. seen it a bunch of times, that's yeah. that's one thing you notice. Um, yeah. Any closing thoughts on 2017? A lot of good movies. A lot of great movies. A lot of good movies. A lot we can probably go into more detail of yeah. at another time. Yeah, I think we uh I think we've pretty much ironed out some new shows. Yeah. Just by talking. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We probably do need to cover more Wind River. Dude. Like, that's really good. Dude. I'm telling you. You need to watch that first. I'm telling you, that. dude. Someone's Wind River that oh, and Gunther. Yeah. Dude, Wind River, it uh <clears throat> Because I know some people that actually live on reservations. I've yeah. got family that live on reservations, and that like fucking hit me hard. Right, right in here. They don't know. They don't. Yeah, no one knows shit about Dude. what happens on them things. Oh man. no, 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 no one cares. Knows. No one knows. There's so many women that go missing. Oh, it's insane. It's it's stupid. Yeah. It's it's insane that we've let it get so bad. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, sounds like a party at the Weinstein place. Yeah, it kind of oh, is. I guarantee it. But at the same time, Kevin Spacey in the background. It's uh, <laughs> well, it, it, it'd be men missing then. Um, but who's to say that didn't happen? You don't know. Oh yeah, you don't. It's know. A reservation. I don't know. Well, you know that's the thing. The thing about reservations is, is that you know, can we keep letting it happen? But at the same time, can we interfere? Like that's well, yeah. Like they don't want us to interfere no, at the same time. No, but yeah. some of them do. Some of them do. It's, some a, don't. it's like a lot. You know, it's like the the really shitty European countries. You yeah. know, when. Like Bosnia, when we inter- well, people are still holding when on. We their, went over like the there. Tri- like the tribes are still holding on to the you know the evil white man thing that yeah. we don't need their well, help. I mean, they, yeah, they, they, we well, are. Well, you, I mean, ever, you ever put a suit on? You ever you ever put a suit on like a real expensive? Do, suit? Do you feel evil? Like, like a nine hundred thousand dollars suit, <laughs> dude? I feel that Every evil. Day. I feel that evil in me when I put that suit on. <laughs> never, I'm not even joking. You better dude. put them glasses down. I'm not even. I'm not joking. No, but I, you look at my eyes. You've I never, went, you've never dude, worn a nine hundred thousand. Oh, yeah, suit. oh yeah, no, no, a nine hundred to thousand dollars. Oh, suit. I thought you said nine hundred thousand. No, suit. no, no, <laughs> no, never no. owned a nine. No, a nine hundred dollar to a thousand dollar suit. You just feel evil, dude. I I want to take shit over. Like I want to own everything. When I put that shit on, I want to own everything. He's got the button, buttons down, his little chest hair coming out, and he's got the gold. Chain. It looks oh, like Tony dude. Montana. I'm not even joking. You he wants a tiger. Tiger. President. I'm not even joking. He wants a tiger. I'm not even joking. <laughs> I'll, I got a tiger right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even joking, dude. I tell you, I'm. No, we are, I said we we are evil sometimes. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Oh, we're all evil, but we're. I mean, we're all evil. That's what I'm saying. I think they. Um, I think a lot of it's just so bad now that they don't want any help from us, and I think it's the ones that aren't into it that far i think but that movie really sheds a lot oh, on, it does. on it does. stuff it does. you know it's, it just it's just real dude yeah. the shootout and everything um, is real it, well and another thing that i love about it i love um oh my god the shit the, like one of my favorite new shows that i can't even think of right now longmire longmire yeah. thank you very much i know what you're talking about absolutely love longmire Every, oh, my, oh dude Long- even the slow parts of longmire are great. amazing oh yeah it's, uh, like it's it's, just, it's it's some of the it's it's already etched it's edged out everything it's already my, in my yeah. top three shows yeah I would say Justified yep and this is no particular yep. order I would Justified say, Longmire twenty four see and I haven't watched all twenty four I can't get over the tick 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 this happens I know I scene. know I know that's a part of the experience that, I know I know I just can't get past Damn it, it Chris I know but I uh, the other two hundred percent agree with you on yeah. Boot that. Here, let's too sweet. Too sweet. It. Too, too sweet. It's better. Um, but no, I absolutely agree. Justified. Do, have you ever seen? Have you ever watched no. Justified? No, I just got into Stranger Things. So, Justified has to be watched. Oh, it has you. to be. There's a lot of slower. I do need. I need to catch on on Stranger Things. Just so we can talk. There's about. a lot yeah. of slower parts on Justified. There's a lot of uh, story building where it's slower. Totally worth it. 
totally yeah. worth it. Dude, the last, oh my God, the last half of the last season was insane. Insane. Yeah. Dude. That's what I've heard. I love it. I love it. Oh, Unjustified, you mean? Yeah. Unjustified. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was insane. Yeah. Oh, where are you talking about? I was just thinking of how how I need to watch Stranger Things season oh, yeah. two still, and and I yeah. and I heard it was like awesome, but um, there's no no Justify wasn't awesome, yeah, and insane. There's probably one episode of Stranger Things that you won't like. One episode. Oh, really? Yeah. It was weird. They tried something new. I know one of my favorite parts in in Justified was I think it was season three was the ice pick. That's my that's absolute like, that's like favorite my, episode. When he fucking, when he fucking, Oh my like he God. just, he just like called him. He did. I mean, he just called his bluff and everything, man. He knew what he's going to do. Like he just fucking read him like a book. Oh, dude. just slid that tablecloth and just, just, just smooth as a cute. Oh my God, dude. That's, it's, that's my bet. That's my favorite episode. Yeah. Hands cool. Down. Cool's a breeze, Love man. Love it. Fucking Raylan Givens is my hero. Yeah. Yeah. In that show. He, he really glor- over glorifies being a marshal. Yeah. Well, and I love like later on in the show, like he's su- he's trying really, really, really hard not to kill anybody, but people just keep just, like I know they I know. keep and like he gets he's starting to get pissed off because mm-hmm. these people keep coming at him. Mm-hmm. He's like, I don't want. He's like, come on, man, I don't want to fucking kill anybody. Well, he's getting in trouble for killing yeah, people. He's like, come on, <laughs> so it's like, and he t- he says that at one point. He's like, come on. Mm-hmm. Just stop. Just yeah, stop. <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> I just don't, I don't want to kill anybody. It's just fine. Dude, he's he's hand like Timothy Oliphant, I don't think he gets enough credit. No, he's as, a man, dude. I as, love him. Uh, I think he's probably one of the best T V actors. He's a cool ass fucking actor. Period. He is. I he's love, a I good even, I even loved him in the girl next door. He's a good movie actor. He's an amazing T V actor. Mm-hmm. Hi. Hi. And anyway. that's totally different acting, too. And we can talk about that in a different time, we can too. Do that too. That's, that'd be a good episode. Any final thoughts on the movies, once again? Uh, No. No? No. No. Cool, dude. No, I can talk about just five. We can talk about just about a week. Save it. Save it, <laughs> Amos. Save it. We got other shows. All right. All right. Bond coming at you next. All right. Peace. I'm out.